Now at six, toxic trouble in Biscayne Bay. We basically saw the oysters in Biscayne Bay were exposed to a higher concentration of both of these chemical groups. Tonight, we're live with more on the contamination concerns. And keeping an eye on Earth while experts are concerned, they say you should not be alarmed. CBS Force Peter Dent joins us live from North Bay Village to explain what this says about the health of Biscayne Bay. It doesn't sound good, like good news, Peter. Well, Ellie, in fact, the FIU scientists say all of the oysters they checked were contaminated. While they say they are not aware of anyone at restaurants, for example, consuming oysters from Biscayne Bay, they say they are troubled by what they found. The study took the FIU scientists to Biscayne Bay, as well as Marco Island and Tampa Bay. They sampled 156 oysters and found all were contaminated with chemicals from areas including landfills, industrial and cosmetic products. FIU scientist Leila Lemos, the author of the study, found the highest exposure in Biscayne Bay. We relate that especially to um, being in a more developed area. And oysters are severely impacted. These animals, uh, they are filter feeding, so uh, they are just filtering whatever it is in the water that we use. What it tells us is these compounds are present in the uh, oysters. It means they are present in the water and, and in the food. Yeah, and then it means that it's present in many other uh, organisms. Natalia Cadete is an FIU assistant professor in the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry. From the study, uh, the only uh, oysters that are used for consumption that, as far as we know, is the ones from Tampa Bay. So we are not aware that there are people actually eating in oysters from Biscayne Bay. These oysters that we, that we collected from Biscayne Bay, they were really small. The scientists study the health risk from consuming oysters from Tampa Bay. Our assessment said that it was of a low risk of being exposed to these contaminants by consuming the oysters from Tampa Bay. Before dining, you may wonder where your oysters come from. Try to find out. First thing yeah. that is really important is for always ask where uh, your food is coming from. And just last month, the EPA said that some of the contaminants were more dangerous than originally thought. Now, it's hoped that this new data will help the experts come up with some new regulations and solutions. We are live in North Bay Village. Peter Danch, CBS 4 News.